Across central New York, auto dealers have seen their products move off the market faster than normal. This, this month was an exceptionally good month for us. We have, uh, we're coming off of the cash for clunkers over the last two or three months. The cash for clunkers program really depleted, uh, in some cases, you know, 30, 40, 50, 60 percent of your normal uh, ground stock or inventory. The government-backed program boosted car sales 20 percent for Ford in the month of August, with fuel-efficient vehicles leading the way. And the dealers are just as optimistic about the sales figures set to come out in the next couple of days. But becoming more faint are the sounds of the Nissan 370Z, a sports car that struggles to get 20 miles to the gallon in city driving. And Allsop says the trend doesn't just mean that four-cylinder cars are in demand. I've also seen the uh, six-cylinders get a lot more efficient. Um, you know, if you get a, uh, an Escape that's a four-cylinder four-wheel drive, it gets 24 to 27 miles to the gallon, where and the V6 is 1926. So, I mean, it's, it's not a huge variety or a change or range in fuel economy. From small SUVs to smaller sedans and to whatever a Nissan Cube may be, the automotive landscape is changing, starting with the Nissan LEAF, an all-electric vehicle which will come out next year. It's supposed to change the automotive marketplace. As for the old-style cars, the sports cars, Rap said that 370Z outside, if he doesn't sell it within the next month, well, it probably won't go until spring. From Bill Rapp Superstore, Ted Conroy, NCC News.